been here seven years now. Um, actually, this month, seven years now. Um, I came in here in um, 2005 as a graphic designer. I started here working in the hotel. Um, I was on a two-year contract. But after on my six month dito, um, biglang may nag, uh, maraming taong nagkakwa na, na who saw my work uh, up uh, online and also on ads. They asked me to help them out. So I started helping one and I got recommended to one and then another one and then another one. In the end, I, got, I had so much clients na, na hindi ko na siya kayang on the side go in. So I decided na to quit my job and to put up my own graphic design and photography studio. So that was my first business dito. And until now, actually, that's still the biggest na, na business venture that I have, the money earner that I have. Tapos, uh, after that, yun, um, uh, it's all about the people kasi na meet mo dito, either fellow Filipinos or people from all over the world na nami meet mo and then um, you collaborate together so that's uh, why I decided to stay my family is here na and uh, my entire life is here na um uh, at your first venture ko in Phnom Penh in the capital city back in Chimbi may mga ilang businesses na ako so this is the first time that I'm venturing out in the capital city and uh, I met uh, uh my business partner ko si Emma na from London uh, na actually um, guest namin siya before sa hotel. Tapos nagustuhan niya yung mga ginagawa namin. Tapos she would buy clothes din sa isang shop namin which is poetry. So nakita niya yung iba't ibang facets na mga ginagawa namin and natutuwa siya. So um, she, decided, she uh, decided to look for us and then uh, she contacted us na na kung gusto namin mag-collaborate together dito kasi gusto gusto niyang mag-open din ng business or something like uh, of that level of what I, I have sa Shimri. It's a combination, it's actually a really quirky combination of a cafe, it's an organic cafe. Um, we source out, you know, the best uh, um, organically grown uh, products from uh, all over Cambodia and all over the metro region. And then um, we do vegetarian food here. Because uh, I'm, I'm vegetarian, si Emma is vegetarian then. So that's why we wanted to have something that dedicated to, to that. Tapos, it's also a, um, a boutique. So we sell a whole lot of our ranges here. Emma is a uh, fashion designer and uh, uh, an accessories designer then back in London. So it's natural lang na uh, sa kanya to um, do the same things that she loves here. Tapos ako naman, I uh, have a whole range of uh, uh, posters, um, shirts, mga postcards and all that that I put na parang it's a about Cambodia then it's a tribute about Cambodia. Tapos, and last but not the least, it's a gallery. It's a gallery space. So um, that's the working formula namin why most of my businesses work in Shimrip is because of the um, gallery and the art side. Because not only that I do the art, but I also um, uh, incorporate you know other Filipino artists and also local artists to to para, para mag, uh, get together para to create a you know um, a great haven for the artists. The <laughs> biggest quality na pa natin, uh, which would make us you know at par with the rest of the world is really our ability na we never say no. Pero in some ways masama din siya. Pero in in more than once na instance mas mabuti siya. That's the that's really our biggest trait. Kasi sa tayo to something na hindi tayo familiar with. Pero we have a passion on it and we believe that we can do it. So talagang we really try to do it in as much uh, power and as much ability that we can para lang, you know, to, um, to try it out. So I think that's one of the reasons why, you know, we always get successful. Kasi like yung mga ibang lahi kasi dito, pag sinabi mong outside of their comfort zone na, ayaw na nila yan. E sa atin, as long as pwedeng, oh, I'll learn something new from this experience or from this uh, work. So, oo tayo, oo, oo, ayan yung go na spirit niyang, uh, I think it's one of our biggest na edge sa, um, sa mundo. Uh, for us, President Aquino's visit here will be very monumental and historic din kasi uh, for the longest time, we haven't had any co-direct na visit dito na, na of that level. Um, and also, um, uh, I think we, we, uh, we feel, we're beginning to feel now, we're being valued then uh, he's visiting us in Cambodia and we're no longer a backwater sa, sa ASEAN. Because of course, like, you know, presidents always visit mga other key players in the region and also all that. And Cambodia used to be parang nasa sideline lang. 
So, parang to to have a visit like this of this magnitude is is a very you know um, uh, uh, we feel very honored as citizens of Cambodia, na, Filipino citizens living in Cambodia. Na, uh, somebody like President Noy Noy would be visiting us, so I think we're very excited about it, and we're we're very hopeful that also the relationship of the Cambodians with the uh, uh, with the Filipinos diplomatic wise would be strengthened, and also there's so much opportunities here, kasi. so uh, I can see na and I can sense that a lot of Filipinos will be very successful here if they you know if they decide to venture out in here as well and uh, uh, train out their expertise here.